Hey everyone, Linda here coming back at you with another video. Welcome back to Adora. I hope everyone's having a fantastic Saturday. Happy Saturday. You can see my jazz hand. Happy Saturday. <laughs> yeah, I'm doing too much. How's everyone doing? Hope you're having a fantastic day today. I know I didn't post for either Tuesday or Thursday. I, I didn't have any uh I didn't have any reading updates because I haven't finished. Look, yeah, I'm behind on reading books. <laughs> I didn't have anything. I at least want to have, like I mentioned before, I at least want to have four or at least five books to come to you with and give you an update. Um, I'm reading on one more book and then I should I should be good next week. But I went to the mailbox and I had my reveal book box. So I was going to do a video anyway today whether I had to reveal books box or not. I was just going to have to do it with like two or three books. But I usually want to come and at least have uh, four or five books. But yeah, it is what it is. So let's get started. I hope we have some good books in here. It's February. Let me rub it. Good books, good books. Hopefully, get this open. See what's going on up in here. Uh, oh, there you go. Get it open. Hope we have something good for February. Get this open. Got some candy first up here. We got some heart pop. See it there. It looks good. Might give that a try. We got the cap. The candle is back in the box. Uh, candle crest. Uh, let's see what this is. But oh, it smell. I can smell it from here. Vanilla peppermint. And it smell like vanilla too. Smell pretty good. Vanilla peppermint. And you can check out their website. What is it? Uh, www.candlecrest.com if you like candles. Premium natural soy, soy candles. Uh, we got some, a box of matches here. The perfect match. So I guess that's why you got your matches. These will come in handy on when your lights go out and you can light some candles. Got a writing pad here. I got. Uh, I think I've got one of these before in the box. Proud Romance Reader. Yes, I'm a proud romance reader. There you go. Got a pen here. What it said? I like my romance to be like my whiskey, intoxicating with a little burn before it feels good. <laughs> that, hey, there you go. Sounds good. And this is, uh, what to say? Oh, this must be from a, a writer. Uh, here's her website, candystein.com. I like that. I like my romance to be like my whiskey, intoxicating with a little burn before it feels good. Hey. Got a book card here, Deception, uh, by C.A. Harm, Harms, H-A-R-M-S. I like this. He's nice looking. See them veins popping in his head? This is nice. I like that. And here's all her contact information. All her, um, you got her face. She's on Facebook. Uh, she's on, she got a website. Uh, author, what is it? AuthorCAharms.com. Got her Twitter, her Instagram, newsletter, Amazon. One sizzling romance at a time. So there's all her information. If you would like to check out C.A. Harms. Have any of you read any of her books? Might have to try this out. If this is the cover on Deception. I love this cover. Thumbs up. Oh, we got a... Uh, I thought they wasn't going to do any more uh, coloring cards. But here's it. It's, it's in a smaller size. Well, maybe it's not... No, it's not romance. Uh, it's not from the Reveal Book Box. It, it's from uh, Don... Drawn to him, I guess this is a uh, book, and this is uh, I guess the writer is Willow Winters. She got her own little card, infatuated. Drawn to him, that I guess that's the name of the book, and drawn to him collection.com. I guess that's the website, and here's all the other um, media, media information. She got Facebook, she got Twitter. Uh, I guess it's this Willow Winters Writes.com. I guess that's her website. And I guess this is like her little logo thing right here. Winter Winters Romance Author. That's kind of cute. 
All right, we got the books in here. Oh, we got a small book this time. This is the first time I ever got like a just a regular sized book. And this is by Jill Shrivers, Plan for Keeps. Got a little dog in here. Oh, look at there. Let's read and see what this is. If you're planning on falling in love when it comes to the confident, charismatic Caleb Parker, when it comes to the confident, charismatic Caleb Parker, Sadie Lane feels the spark. The kind that come from rubbing each other the wrong way. She's a tap tattoo artist. He's a straight, uh-oh, I'm already all in already. She's a tattoo artist. And he's a straight late mogul. Okay. Opposite of track. I'm all in for them opposite of track romances. Love them. But after they accidentally co-rescue an abandoned dog from a storm, Sadie sees a vulnerable side to the seemingly invincible hottie. That sounds good. And it said a first time in print. I'm going to have to give this out. I think I read Jill. Did she used to write for a Harlequin? Or did she write? Is this a Harlequin? No, this Avon Books. I don't know. It looked like I remember her name from somebody. I don't remember if I've read anything. It looked like I've read, but I can't remember. But I'm going to check this out. We got the opposite of track romance. Yes. Sounds good. Next, we got, uh -oh, we got all tattooed it up. And this is called sex material. Okay. This might, this looks, this sounds like going to be a little bit of hot and steaming that's going on here. Sex material. And this is by Victoria Ashley. But they said, my new landlord, uh-oh, my, land, my new landlord is a complete a-hole. Okay. I love this cover. Can you see those eyes on this? Look at his eyes. They stand out. Oh, my goodness. He look like a vampire right there with them eyes. <laughs> Let's see, can I read the back of here? A rock hard body covered in tattoos with a sizable uh oh with a sizable budge that women spend their nights fantasizing about. Women track me down needing someone that will uh oh I'm not gonna read all that yeah we got some language in there I'll skip that part <laughs> that will you know what them rough without holding back. They find me because they need a distraction from reality. They need something to get their mind off of the boyfriend who screwed them over or the job promotion that got passed over on at work. Sometimes it's just because they need someone reckless in the bedroom before settling down with the right one. Because I'm sure as hell not that guy. Nowhere close. I'm not the suit wearing, flower buying guy you take home to meet the parents. I'm not the guy who will make you feel all warm and whatever fuzzy inside i'm gonna read this whole thing this sounds interesting not anymore i was boyfriend material once would have even made a good husband until one night changed everything oh lord is this gonna be like a second chance romance i hope not <laughs> these women come to me because they need an escape to cope with the real world but none of them know i need it more than them i need something to make me feel alive something to get my heart beating again then Cammie shows up in my hometown, brokenhearted and pissed off at the world, needing an escape from her cheating ex. She's the only one that doesn't want to use my body. In fact, she wants nothing to do with it and has no problem telling me so. She's interested in one thing only from me, to move into my rental property. But the problem with that is the more we fight, the deeper she buries herself in my soul. Uh-oh. Sex material is what I'm good at. But for the first time, it may not be enough. I thought we was heading toward a, um, what is it, a uh, second chance romance. I was like, oh, please. But no, it's not that. So, yeah, all of this, I had to read this whole thing. All of that sounded good. Sex material sounds good. I hope it, uh, I hope it uh, read as good as it's read on the back. And here's a Victoria Ashley a website, victoriaashleyauthor.com. I'm excited about both of these. Yes. Fantastic cover. Opposite of track romance. I'm all in. Yes. So let's put all this back in here. I'm excited to read those. Get these all back in here. I might have to put those two on my next um, TBR. And check those out. I love this um, little pen here. Love it. I love this picture they got on here too. Nice. 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 Let's put all this back in here. I'm going to leave out my candy. Oh, and I'll leave the um, candle out because I'll burn that in my room tonight. 
And that's all I have for now. I hope y'all enjoyed my little reveal book box because I really did. I really, really enjoyed it. I like both of those books. Fan freaking tastic. And that's all I have for now. Hopefully next week I will come to you. Uh, I need just need to finish up one more book. I need to get on it this weekend and get that book taken care of. And then I can do my Tuesday or Thursday reading update. But until then, keep reading those romances and I'll see you later. Well, sometime next week. Have a great evening. Bye.